Today we're going to be talking about doing revisions on a document using three apps. We're going to first use uh, Google Docs, uh, Notability, and Google Drive. You'll start by being assigned a person or you'll have a person that is going to be the one that's going to make suggested revisions for you. So your first step is going into the document you want to have revisions made to in your Google Docs and then up at the top of that document you're going to click on the little guy at the top with the plus sign which then allows this drop back down box to happen. This is where you're going to share it with the person um, that you want to do revisions for you. Remember at our school in order to do that you'll use the first name dot last name at Students, don't forget that S, dot ccsk12.com. Once you have shared the, your document with your partner and your partner has shared theirs with you, you're then going to open up your Google Drive and go to your Shared With Me to look for the document that your partner has shared with you and then open it up. Once your friend's document is opened, you're going to click on the three buttons up on the top and then you're going to click Share and Export send a copy, make sure it's a PDF, and then you're going to click on Open in Notability. Once inside Notability, you'll notice that you have tools at the top uh, that will allow you to do some editing and revisions. You've got a pencil, you've got a highlighter, eraser, you can cut, you can move, you can type, all these things to help you in your revision suggestions. If you hold your finger over one of these options, for instance, right now the highlighter is highlighted. If I hold my finger down, it gives me options within just that one tool. And as always, undo is your friend. If you ever do something on the screen that you would prefer not to happen, you can always uh, tap and hold undo uh, in order to make it disappear. Once you have the revisions like you would like them to be, you can click on this um, up arrow button up here and then you're going to use go down and you're going to save these revisions that you've made to your Google Drive. In order to do that, once you click on Google Drive, you're then going to see this pop up. Um, make sure that you save it in the folder that makes sense. So in other words, if this is for language arts, you want to go out and find your language arts folder. Also make sure you're always saving this as a PDF. And then once you've got the right folder there, which may mean you have to sign into your Google Drive through Notability, then you're going to go down and you're going to click Send to Google Docs. This is an example of when I hit um, the folders, it opened up all the folders that I could possibly send it to in um, my Google Drive to choose from the right one. Yours will all show up so you'll see all the different folders that you have set up in your Google Drive right here. Your next step is then to go to your Google Drive. So you're exiting out of your Notability, you're going to your Google Drive, and you're going to find um, in the folder that you just saved it to the document that you just saved in Notability. So here's what I just did. Uh, in the right folder, the correct folder, and then I'm going to open that up and I am going to, this is the next screen, um, add people. So the person I, that just shared that with me, I made adjustments to it. I want to add them to this document so they can see it. So once again, up at the top of my Google Doc, I'm going to click on add people, which is right up here. And then this is going to pop up, and right here, I'm going to type in their email address. The same exact person that I that shared it that I shared with in the beginning. I'm now going to share this back to them. First dot last at students dot ccs k twelve dot com is how that works at our school. Once you've got it, 
um, the way you want it, then you're going to go down and just save it. The last step in this process is that then you'll both go into your shared with me in your Google Drive and you're going to open up and look at the suggested revisions that your partner just made with you. Then you'll decide, yes, I like these revisions. These are probably good ideas for my document. You'll open up your document and you'll make the revisions that were suggested.